So this next video is of a heat signature at Pendle Hill, which uh, likes to whistle from within the field. So I'm going to show you. Um, I'm going to show you a clip now, and um, you know um, I can't really explain this because it's not a sheep by any means. So I'll let you see the video right about now. Did the witches of Pendle Hill leave behind a curse that still haunts the living today? In 1612, 12 people from the small village of Pendle were accused of witchcraft and sentenced to death. But what if their vengeful spirits never left? Some say that the ghosts of the accused still roam the misty hills, trapped between our world and the next. Pendle Hill has become notorious for strange sightings and eerie occurrences. Visitors report hearing whispers in the wind, seeing shadowy figures, and feeling an icy grip in the dead of night. Is it just the imagination running wild, or is there something more sinister at play? Local legends speak of a curse laid down by the witches as they face the gallows, a curse that lingers over Pendle Hill to this day. Could the souls of the innocent be crying out for justice, or are they seeking revenge? The truth may never be known, but one thing is certain, Pendle Hill is shrouded in a darkness that even time cannot erase. That's funny that, because he went to fucking fall then. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, you went. You <laughs> fell over that fucking bump there, where you can't see because the thermal camera's on, and it said examine. So it's more or less saying examine the fucking floor. Watch where you're going. Yeah, watch where you're going, yeah. So the first word we got was uh, examine. Uh, there's a bit more to that word than actually what we thought. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Right, okay, I'm watching, I'm going. <clears throat> Means we're being watched. Which I've kind of figured with the, with the, um, with the magnetism. Watch out, because there's another one here, look. Another one there. Uh, so the equipment's picking up uh, unknown magnetism or magnet anomalies with uh, no credible source. Quite a lot of What's that? Yeah. Still nothing on the Randonautica crap, which, in theory, yeah, it's not the end of the world because we've still got research doing the woods. See what I mean about the fucking pings? Mm. Just stand still. I'm trying to catch them orbs as they're flying past in front of the camera. Annoyed. Annoyed? Why is that? So I'm waiting for a ping and then a fucking an anomaly to fly past, hopefully. Do you wanna do you wanna fly in front of Undecided. No, that's what I'm trying to get at now, yeah, is if you can fly in between us. And I'll be able to see you on the thermal camera if you ping on the and you fly between us both where the light is. I'm getting something in here, but I think it's just due to some light refraction, but it's really, really weird. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's coming off your torch. Is it? Yeah. All right. Yeah, it's coming off your torch. Is it? Yeah. All right. So hopefully you heard that whistle and there's a heat signature just behind us in the field. I don't actually know what that is, but whatever it is, whistled. Oh, so oh, yeah. that's what I'm fucking talking about there, them pings. Do you know what I mean? As soon as I thought, Let, let's fucking move on, it starts pinging. And I was ready then, f f throughout that time I'm being stood here, I'm waiting for it to ping so I can try and capture the magnet anomalies that are flying past. Right, just now, you feel like we've just stopped for a minute. Yeah. And yet again, I feel like we've gone into another layer. Yeah. You were saying that on the way here, weren't you? Yeah, I feel like it's sort of... <coughs> I don't know, like... Gone to another thing now. Yeah. Enemy. <laughs> Who's the enemy? See, see what it is, Tradition. yeah. Tradition, right? Yeah. I'm with you. Right, to the to the spirit or the entity, yeah, that's communicating with us, yeah. I've got a picture now, yeah, and you can come and draw something that's got some kind of relevance in what you're trying to describe, yeah. So you can come and hit my device if you want, yeah. And you can come and draw something to give yourself some relevance if you think that that's 
something you want to do. Something you want to do. There. Yeah. Good smell. Does it? What of? I can't make out what that is. Yeah. Let it serve. What smells? What's the smell? What's that? Someone having sleep paralysis, if you ask me. Well, let's look at that further. It's like someone's bedroom or something. Let's keep moving, Matt. I can see this being a long. So this is a picture that was drawn. I just want to talk uh, back about the heat signature that uh, that was within a hundred yards. That heat signature. Uh, so I don't actually know what that is. And this said, um, obviously when I got this picture, it said it smells, which is I think it's referring to a time um, I came back uh, earlier on this year, uh, and we thought there was a dead sheep not far away because it, you know, obviously there was a bad smell. So um, I'm only assuming that this picture is related to a previous experience that he had at Pendlehill.